everybody, it's Lurgs here. Welcome to my channel. And today I'm going to show you how to use the Ready Boost feature to increase the performance of your Windows 10 computer or laptop. Now, this is really handy if your computer is getting really slow. Windows 10 does lots of updates all the time, and your computer will gradually get slower and slower. I'll also show you how to check the RAM on your laptop or computer. And then finally, at the end, it's really important to eject your USB ready stick correctly. Otherwise, you could have some data corruption. Right, let's get cracking. There is a link above now about how to take screenshots in Windows 10. Now take your USB stick. This one is only an 8 gig model, but I recommend a minimum size of 64 gigabytes. Plug that into the side of your laptop in the USB socket. And then that will pop up on your screen. So go to File Explorer. Click on the external drive and then right click and then select properties. And as you can see here, I've got just under two gigabytes of space because I've got some other bits on here. Now on the top, select the Ready Boost tab. Now you can dedicate this device to Ready Boost or you can just use this device and use a certain amount of storage. I'm just going to select the maximum, so all two gigabytes. And there's a link above now about how to print multiple pictures on one page in Windows 10. Once that's finished, then click on OK. And now if we click on the E drive, the external USB stick, you'll notice that it's got a cache file here of two gigabytes. Now that's what it's going to use for the virtual RAM. Now I will just show you what happens if you try and use a USB stick ready boost on a computer that's already too fast. You will get this message. As I mentioned earlier, it's really important that you eject the USB stick correctly after you've finished using it. Now what you do is you go back to the USB stick external drive, go back to the ready boost function tab, and then select do not use this device and then click on apply. Now you will notice in the background that two gigabyte cache file has now disappeared. And there's a link above now about how to put your laptop into airplane mode easily. Once you've applied that do not use this device, then you can eject the USB stick. Normally just go to the taskbar, right click on it and then eject this USB stick. And then it will say safe to remove the hardware. And then you can remove your USB stick. And there's a link above now about how to check your RAM and system specifications in Windows 10. And I'll tell you what, after all that hard work, it's definitely time for a lovely cup of tea. Oh. If you would like more how-to videos on how to save time and money, then please press the subscribe button down here. I really do appreciate you visiting my channel, everyone. If 